nice to have it all unpacked and laid out. It took about an hour and a half to do that. So I'll have a route through the instructions and see what the crack is. Okay, we start organizing everything. See where we are. We leave all the wrapper on it just because I might bang it off something as we're doing things. And these are all the bits. And then we go. Now, here's the, our list of parts. Here's all our instructions. Look at that now. Just starting to rain. Absolutely brilliant. Let me get going with these. Put the plates on the end of all of these. Get moving. That's those four uprights all done, so see what's on next. So I get a bit more cardboard because I don't want them to get scratched. The other side. This from doing the furniture. So, pretty handy. Matched up. But to be fair to them, it's labelled really well like D1, D1, D2, D2. They're all matched up, and the instructions are very good. So, yeah, one thing with it is they say don't build it when it's windy, but it's always windy here. So, have much choice and I really don't want to scratch it so put that over there okay that's them two done Bit in that bit, then mm. this he made it upside down. What a break in half. D1, D2. I can't go outside because it's actually too fucking small. Look at that bent. great John and Lorenzo came over and gave me a hand so it just made it a lot easier I was tempted to have a go at it on my own but uh, I probably just would have broken one of the hinges and it only took a few minutes once you had a set of hands so hey, I was thinking when you put the um, concrete yeah do you need a level have a long no, I'm okay. Thank you. I have one. Oh, okay. Yeah, thank you very much. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.
Okay, so that's the gutters. Did they get mounted in, do they? So these are the gutters, but there's meant to be a plastic connector piece that fits in there, but it's not in the box. I was very careful about organizing everything at the start. So what we're gonna do, let's see what we can figure out. goes like that. Okay. I've no idea why they've Got me to put the gutters in first and then try and ram this in afterwards. It doesn't make any sense. But anyway. It's very fiddly. The light makes it hard to see, but we're getting there. just get stuck into pushing these up and on. Oh. So that's, that's the correct position at the moment. Well, I have to check. I don't, I mean, maybe you know, I'm trying to get it straight. Now, obviously level is, level is easy. That's just, the le this bit, having that level is easy. I'm just trying to make sure it's, yeah. I don't know how to do it though. <laughs> I hope this patio is square, then as you see, I can measure the other distance, same distance here and there. Yeah. So that's... Ok, 
Okay. Right. Uh, Which one do you want to do first? These or the? Um, maybe them slabs. Yeah. Okay. Let me get these out of your way fast then. Yeah. Okay. Of all this stuff to finish and then we're done. This is a bit wobbly. Nearly there, another 25 of them on this side, and then... Now... Those fixings on the other side are too tight though because Are they too tight? Okay, let's have a 
a look at that and see if it makes it a bit easier. Nearly there. Um, we're pretty much done, almost, 